Press Now. Good Friday evening to you. Thanks for joining us tonight on News Press Now at 9. I'm Charles Christian. Well, anyone traveling west along the U.S. Route 36 over the Missouri River will have to continue dealing with one lane traffic this winter. Our own Morgan Doyle spoke with the Missouri Department of Transportation and tells us what drivers can expect. MoDOT recently announcing work on the Pony Express Bridge has been suspended for the winter. Westbound U.S. Route 36 will continue to be one lane, and the ramp from Route 759 to Westbound 36 will remain closed. We certainly understand it's an inconvenience to the traveling public, and it's, it's unfortunate because we, um, we were able to complete a majority of the work and there's just a little bit remaining on that east end that we couldn't get completed. Work on the bridge was expected to be done by December 1st, but additional repairs were needed that caused the timeline to be pushed back. I'll be a nervous wreck. <laughs> Carmel Rickliffs lives in Wathena, but works in St. Joseph. Along with this being an inconvenience, she's worried about the safety of drivers this winter. I do have to take an alternate route home to get onto 36. But what I'm concerned about is the winter time with the snow and the ice because or if people get stalled on the bridge, then what what's everybody else do? MoDOT tells drivers to be aware of the area and know when traveling west, the right lane will be exit only and the left lane will continue as a one lane on westbound Route 36. The two most important things you can do are to buckle up and foam down. The new estimated completion date is June 2023. Work had to be suspended for the winter due to temperature sensitive tasks such as pouring concrete. Modon tells me they have winterized the area. They've removed rumble strips and cones and put down permanent striping. There are also many signs along the route, some of which you can see here behind me, informing drivers of the work area. They say this is all in an attempt to make the area more visible and easy to see. The bridge rehabilitation project was originally set to cost almost $6 million. There's no word yet on how much more the additional work will cost. Morgan Doyle, News Press Now.